Gerald, Gerald, my dear brother, brother and friend, he wanted and worked so hard to get a Grammy. You know when he got his Grammy? When his eyes was closed and his feet was cold. They decided they wanted, oh, they decided how talented and what this guy, the work that he had put in of doing this. And listen, it might end up being my story too. I don't know, but at the end of the day, <sighs> You, you, know. you never know, man. Gerald Lever is greatly missed even today. His was a big shock to everyone, but what if I told you that the hidden truth behind his is downright heartbreaking? These details haven't seen light of the day until now. In the realm of R&B, few stories resonate with the depth and complexity of Gerald Leverts. His voice, a rich tapestry of soulful echoes, carried the weight of a legacy inherited and a future envisioned. Oh, baby. Of age, you realize the things that are important. You realize about your health. You realize after you see people pass away. As a pivotal figure in the genre, Gerald's journey through music was not a solitary voyage, but a shared expedition with Levert, the group he formed alongside his brother Sean and friend Mark Gordon. Think about just the whole concept of the world. It becomes much deeper than how much money you got. It becomes much deeper than how big is your house. Gerald Levert's life is a tale of opposites, a balancing act between the bright glare of fame and the dark weight of its demands, between the blissful act of making music and the private battles it brought. His path, filled with the peaks of hit songs dominating the charts and the valleys of heartbreaking losses, reflects the essence of R&B itself, a style of music that embraces every emotion, from elation to sorrow. So you're still able to see what's happening, you know what I'm saying? And then you can get caught up in that. And when you do have money, you know, you become, you might become a part of that. The Levert story starts in Cleveland, Ohio. Gerald and Sean Levert, sons of Eddie Levert from the OJs, teamed up with their friend Mark Gordon to form a group that would become legendary in the music world. Gerald, the older brother, was a natural talent. He had a voice that could calm or excite just like his dad. But it wasn't just about following his father's footsteps. Gerald was obsessed with music. Sean, on the other hand, wasn't initially keen on a music career, but he found his groove in the group, adding depth to their sound. Mark Gordon, their childhood buddy, brought his own skills to the mix, completing the trio that would become known for their top-notch R&B. Starting out wasn't easy. People didn't take them seriously at first. Critics and record labels thought they were just copying the OJs and didn't recognize the fresh R&B style Levert was creating. But they didn't let that stop them. They poured their hearts into their music, practicing tirelessly in Gerald's family basement. Their hard work paid off when Atlantic Records noticed them. Their second album, Bloodline, launched Levert into the spotlight. Hits like Pop, 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 Pop Goes My Mind and Casanova not only showcased Gerald's amazing voice, but also the group's ability to connect with audiences on an emotional level. Casanova especially put them on the map, earning them their first Grammy nomination and securing their spot in R&B history. As Levert's star rose, so did the pressures and expectations. The success of The Big Throwdown and Just Coolin' brought fame and accolades, but it also highlighted the complexities of navigating the music industry. Gerald, in particular, felt the weight of these challenges. His desire to push the boundaries of R&B and explore new creative avenues led to tensions within the group and with their record label. Yet it was this relentless drive to innovate that would propel Gerald into a successful solo career, even as Levert continued to captivate audiences. As the success of Levert cemented their place in the annals of R&B history, Gerald Levert embarked on a journey that would further define his legacy. This chapter of his life was not just about about stepping out from the shadows of a group dynamic, but about exploring the depths of his musicality and the breadth of his creative vision. Gerald's solo career was a testament to his versatility as an artist and his unwavering commitment to his craft. The decision to go solo was driven by a desire for artistic exploration rather than a departure from Levert. Gerald saw it as an opportunity to delve into themes and sounds that were deeply personal, to tell stories that resonated with his own experiences and aspirations. His solo debut, Private Line, was a bold proclamation of his arrival as a standalone powerhouse in the R&B scene. The album, featuring the hit duet Baby Hold On To Me with his father, Eddie Levert, showcased not only his vocal prowess, but also his skill as a songwriter and producer. Gerald's solo work was characterized by its emotional depth and musical diversity. He navigated the complexities of love, 
pain and joy with a sincerity that spoke directly to the hearts of his listeners. Tracks like I Swear, Thinking About It, and Taking Everything became anthems of the human condition, echoing the struggles and triumphs that define our lives. Yet Gerald's journey was not without its challenges. The transition from group member to solo artist brought with it the pressures of living up to the Levert legacy while carving out his own the music industry, ever-changing and unforgiving, demanded constant innovation and adaptation. Gerald met these demands head-on, pushing the boundaries of R&B with each album and collaboration. His work with other artists and groups, including the supergroup LSG with Keith Sweat and Johnny Gill, highlighted his ability to blend styles and influences, further solidifying his status as a musical chameleon. Despite the accolades and commercial success, Gerald remained grounded in his roots. His music, while evolving, always retained the soulful essence that was his signature. He was not just performing, he was sharing a part of himself with the world a vulnerability that endeared him to fans and peers alike. Behind the curtain of fame and the glow of the spotlight, Gerald Levert faced battles that were deeply personal and profoundly human. His journey through the peaks and valleys of life was marked by struggles that tested his resilience, both and emotionally. These challenges, while often hidden from the public eye, played a significant role in shaping the artist and the man he became. Gerald's struggle with weight was a public aspect of his personal battles. The pressures of maintaining an image suitable for the stage and screen weighed heavily on him, mirroring the societal expectations placed on celebrities. This battle was more than cosmetic. It was a health concern that Gerald took seriously. His commitment to addressing his weight issues was not just about aesthetics, but about longevity, both in his career and life. The journey was fraught with challenges as the demands of his profession often conflicted with the needs of his body. Yet Gerald faced these challenges head on, openly discussing his struggles and the steps he was taking to overcome them. More hidden from the public eye, however, were Gerald's battles with pain, both f and emotional. The f toll of a lingering shoulder problem and a severe Achilles tendon injury required surgery and led to chronic pain. Gerald turned to prescription medication to manage this pain, a decision that would have far-reaching consequences. The reliance on these medications, while under medical advice, introduced a complexity into Gerald's life that he navigated with caution but could not entirely escape. The emotional pain Gerald endured was intertwined with his struggles. Anxiety attacks, a manifestation of the immense pressure and stress of his career, became another battle for Gerald. He sought solace in Xanax, a medication prescribed for anxiety, which he took alongside his pain medication. This combination of prescriptions, while intended to address specific health issues, hinted at the broader challenge of managing mental health in the high-stakes environment of the music industry. Gerald's personal struggles were a stark contrast to the powerful, confident persona he presented on stage, yet they were a testament to his humanity, to the vulnerability that lies beneath the surface of every individual, regardless of their fame or success. Gerald's openness about his battles, particularly with weight, offered a glimpse into the man behind the music, one who faced his challenges with determination and sought to overcome them with the support of his family, friends, and fans. These struggles, while personal, were not fought in isolation. They were shared, in part, through his music, which continued to resonate with themes of love, loss, and resilience. Gerald's ability to channel his personal experiences into his art added a layer of authenticity to his work, making his songs not just melodies and lyrics, but expressions of a life lived with all its complexities. On November 10, 2006, the music world was shaken to its core by the sudden loss of Gerald Levert. At just 40 years old, a beacon of R&B, known for his soul-stirring vocals and profound lyrical d was extinguished. Gerald's d was not just a personal tragedy for his family and close friends, but a monumental loss to the music industry and his fans worldwide. The cause, as revealed by the coroner's report, was an accidental overdose, a lethal combination of prescription narcotics and over-the-counter further complicated by an underlying pneumonia. This tragic end brought to the forefront the silent battles Gerald had been fighting. Known for his vibrant personality and powerful stage presence, few were aware of the health issues he grappled with behind the scenes. Gerald's reliance on prescription medication for chronic pain management, stemming from a lingering shoulder problem and a severe Achilles tendon injury, painted a starkly different picture from the one fans were accustomed to. It highlighted the vulnerability hidden beneath the facade of celebrity. Gerald's passing underscored the pressures faced by those in the spotlight and the often overlooked mental and 
physical toll it can take. The music industry, while glamorous on the surface, demands constant performance and perfection, sometimes at the expense of the artist's well-being. Gerald's struggle with anxiety, managed through prescribed Xanax, and his battle with weight, which he publicly addressed, were indicative of the broader challenges he faced in balancing his health with the expectations of his career. In the wake of Gerald Levert's untimely passing, the music industry and fans alike were left to grapple with the profound loss of an R&B titan. Gerald's death not only marked the end of an era, but also initiated a period of reflection on his indelible impact on the genre and the lives he touched through his music and persona. His legacy, rich with soulful melodies and heartfelt lyrics, became a source of comfort and remembrance for those mourning his absence. The aftermath of Gerald's saw an outpouring of tributes from peers, collaborators, and admirers. Award shows and musical tributes celebrated his contributions, highlighting the depth of his influence and the void his departure left in the music world. Posthumously, Gerald's work continued to garner acclaim, with unreleased tracks and albums being shared with the public, serving as a bittersweet reminder of his unmatched talent and the potential for more that would remain unrealized. Beyond the accolades and posthumous releases, Gerald's legacy prompted a broader discourse on the pressures of fame and the importance of mental and physical health, especially within the entertainment industry. His passing shed light on the often overlooked struggles faced by artists behind the glamour, sparking conversations about the need for support systems and awareness around health issues, both and mental. Gerald's family, particularly his father, Eddie Levert, and his children became torchbearers of his legacy, ensuring that his contributions to music and his spirit lived on. They shared personal stories and memories, offering insights into Gerald's life beyond the stage, humanizing the icon and keeping his memory alive in the hearts of fans. Gerald Levert's influence on R&B is immeasurable, transcending his own discography to inspire a new generation of artists. His soulful delivery and earnest songwriting set a benchmark, encouraging authenticity and emotional depth in the genre. The legacy of Levert, the group, and Gerald's solo career continues to be celebrated, influencing not just musicians, but anyone who seeks to connect deeply through the power of music. Reflecting on Gerald Levert's life and career offers valuable lessons about the complexity of fame, the importance of health, and the enduring power of music. His journey reminds us of the human behind the artist, urging a balance between passion and well-being. Gerald's story is a poignant chapter in the history of R&B, highlighting the need for compassion and understanding in the fast-paced world of music. That's all for the video, folks. Thanks for watching.